Um, today we are doing my favorite thing. We are doing savings challenges. I love them. That's what keeps me going week after week. Um, so if that is something you're interested, then stick around and watch this video. For anybody new out there, my name is Free and you're watching Budgeting with Free. And I do cash stuffings twice a month. I do savings challenges every week. I do low income cash stuffing once a month for my mom's social security income. And other than that, um, I just do some random things. Sometimes I do YouTube shorts on some of the projects and crafts that I'm doing. And on that note, since we're talking about that, last night on the live was unbelievable craziness for me. Um, it was an amazing live because it was Chrissy from The Mom Life. It was her birthday and she chose to feature me on the live and um, we did an amazing deal on my pens and I blew them out. You guys, I'm going to be making pens 24 seven <laughs> for the next few days to try and get them all but I am working on them. They're all getting made and packaged and I will get them all out to you as soon as I can. I can't thank you all enough. This is the most supportive, amazing community ever. Um, I've never seen anything like it. The support, the kind words, you guys are, you guys just blow me away. I'm speechless at what you guys have done for me. Just amazing. I have officially kicked off my Etsy shop and throughout the week I'm gonna be, um, there's certain things that I do have made and ready to go. So I will be popping those in my shop throughout the week. Um, these are some notebooks that I have been working on. Um, they just need to be put together and listed in my shop, which I will be doing. So this is going to be the ASIC size. Um, it'll be a cash binder as soon as I put the pieces of it together, but I did make the cover and the backing for that. Um, then I also have the same type of one in a red. The backing to this one is currently drying. And then if you guys remember this one, I did the YouTube short on this one that you guys saw and I have the back to that one somewhere down here, I think. Huh, I'll come across it. Then I have this, these are all A7 size. This is going to be a clear, um, just got silver flakes in it, as well as glitter inside of it. So again, this one also needs still needs to be put together. And then this is going to be a notebook that I'm putting together. I don't know if you can see it, it's the pink with the pink glitter, and that'll be the back. Again, it needs to be put together with paper added to it. And then this is the backing to another notebook that I made. Again, it needs to be put together. It just says you can't have a rainbow without a little rain. It's a boho-ish type image. So yeah, that's what I have been working on last week to get up into my shop and I was doing the mad dash yesterday to try to get stuff put into the shop and um, as you see I am still working on it I still have items to list so if you don't see something that you like in the shop please um, wait check back and hopefully I'll have something there that you like other than that I'm just working on pens this week so I can get all you guys' orders out the door um, and I will be starting to list pens in the Etsy shop as well. So look out for that additionally. Okay, so let's get to savings challenges. Let's see how much money I have today. 
And let me get my pash tray out. Okay, so today I have 100, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 210, 215, 220, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 255. I probably won't use all of it today, but we'll see how far I get. So let me see how I can arrange my workspace here so that way you guys can see what's going on. All right. I do need to pull out. Remember I, I told you guys I was going to try and track my spending and I told you I was terrible at it. Yeah, I'm still terrible at it. I was not able to do it. Okay. Um, This is the sheet I want. This kind of guides me. I kind of pre-plan what I'm doing on my savings challenges and how much money I'm allotting to each item. Um, so the savings countdown. So I've been doing it on my own um, behind the scenes. And just to kind of go over it with you, day one, I picked $7. Day two was a dollar. Day three was 10. Day four was three, day five was 10, and day today was $9. Um, and my things that I had to do for myself, remember I'm also adding into this challenge um, something that'll help me either mentally, emotionally, or um, physically, or nutritionally. And so the things I chose this week were 20 minutes on my treadmill, a long bath, which by the way was amazing salad for lunch on day three, yoga on day four, and I did not get a chance to pull on day five. So today I need to walk to my gazebo, which is in my development, and I have to drink eight glasses of water. So I need to get started on that. I'm way behind. So anyways, that money is being kept in this envelope and I'm not counting it. It's going to be a surprise and it's a present to myself for after Christmas so I can do something nice for myself. So, okay. All right, so the first one we are doing today is going to be the 52 week challenge. And I am doing week number, I need to get my marker or my pen. I am doing doo -doo -doo, number 24 and 25. So let's go ahead and color in 24 and color in 25. So that's gonna be $49. All right, so let's do 20, 40, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. Let's see what we have in 52 weeks. So today we're adding 49, and let's see how much we have. So we have 200, two placeholders here. And then I'm gonna add this to the mix and see how much we have. So we have 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 300, 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 325 dollars. So crazy, makes me so happy because that means I get to stuff my daughter's chair folder. So one thing I am gonna do though is 20, 40, 60, 60, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 100. So I'm gonna change this out because I need to break the 100 that's sitting in here. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Let's go ahead and do this for a 20. 
Okay. Exciting stuff. Okay, we are done with that one. And then the next one we're doing is the 50 envelope. And for the 50 envelope, I am doing, let's see, I should have pre-pulled all these envelopes, which I did not, I'm so sorry. I'm doing 26. Um, nope, I lied. Oh yeah, 26, 22, oh look at that, 14. 26, 22, and 14. So that should be, let's go ahead and, so we have 20, five, and 26. Then we had 20, one, and 22. And then we had 14, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So let's go ahead and stuff these guys. Big shout out to Mom Life. Happy birthday. I hope it was a good birthday for you. You look like you were having fun. You looked so cozy in your your little uh, reindeer outfit. It was so much fun. So I hope you all had a great time. Okay, so we're going to color in number 14. 22. And 26. And let's see what color I'm going to do today. I'm just going to pick a random color without looking. And it looks like we're doing orange. So I cannot wait to finish this one. And you know, this whole thing will be going to my daughter's cheer. Guys, I cannot wait until I'm done with cheerleading. The amount of money that goes to this sport is just insane. I can't even. Just her little blingy little outfit by itself, not including shoes, makeup, makeup bags, um, whatever else they were, a jacket, oh, with the jacket. So the, the cheer piece, I'm missing one here or there. The one cheer outfit is $600. Then they have a, they were required to buy the jacket, which is another $100. Then we're required to buy the specific cheer shoes, which was another $100. And then there's specific makeup we have to buy that was $50. And the makeup bag, I don't know why they require it, but they require a makeup bag that was like another $40 or something like that. It's just, that's insane. So you spent like thousands of dollars before you even start the season. I'm going to be glad when that's over. Okay, so we are done with our 50 envelope. And the next one we're doing is roll the dice. I love this one. I love all of them. Okay, so we are doing, oh, we got a double, oh, triple. Look at that. Three fours. Holy moly. Okay. So let's go ahead and get out $12, 10, 11, 12. We'll set that to the side and let me color this in. I need blue and yellow and red today. So let's do fours. We're gonna rack in the fours today. Okay, so let's do this four, yellow four. And a blue four. And because we got doubles, we're rolling all three dice again. Let's see what we got. Okay, we got a three, a four, and a five. So that's another $12. 10, 11, 12. And I'm actually going to take this five. One, two, three, four. Oh. Okay, never mind. Okay, um, oh my gosh. Okay, we had four, eight, 12 the first time, and I need 
five, nine, 12 on this one. Okay, we're good. So let me go ahead and color those in. We needed a red three. And we had a yellow four. Oh my God, you guys, this is so exciting. I'm almost done with this section. And a blue five. Okay. So we can put the dice away. And let's see what we have. So today we are adding, looks like $24 plus 24. So let's see what that leaves us with. Okay. So we have $100 placeholder, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So we have $211 in here. And I am going to, what am I going to do? 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 10. Let's do that because I need singles. Okay, take this 20. Right. 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 20, 31. No, 20, 40, 60, 80, 20, oh my God, I can't count. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 11. That's right. Okay. Next one we are working on is my emergency fund. And the emergency fund is going to get $10, my usual. So let's go ahead and color in a 10. And that will wrap it up for the third row on here. <laughs> Made it to our fourth row. So we're adding 10, so that'll be $240. So let's see, we have 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. 240. Okay. Investments. So as I mentioned on my last video, I already have December funded, so it's ready to go. So what I'm doing now is adding on top of my $31 to go ahead and put another $31 into maybe last month's funds or the months before just to um, gain more share of the, stock, the stocks that I'm investing in. So I'm gonna go ahead and add another $10 to this. So we will go ahead and color 10 more of these. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And then we'll just put that money in here. And at the end of the month, we'll see how much money I end up with to reinvest. Okay, butterfly challenge. We are doing $20. So we're gonna do this 20 that I messed up on last week and go ahead and color that in. Okay, and then we'll add $20 to our beautiful butterfly which is from Lisa Grateful Me, if anyone was interested in getting this. Plus 20, and she has 89.199. She has um, come out with a ton more printables 
and oh my gosh, I could buy them all and do them all, and I know I can't, and it makes me crazy because so many people are coming out with the cutest things, and I want to do them all, and if I try and do them all, I won't be able to afford to do any, so I don't know what to do. Okay, anyways, I'm going to take it day by day, see how I do. All right, so butterfly challenge, we currently have a $100 placeholder. 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, $199. Christy, you need some fives? I got some for you here. Okay. Um, and I am going, just because it's just how I am and it's gonna drive me crazy, is I'm gonna go ahead and fill in this $1 one. I think red is one dollar yeah I'm gonna add this one dollar one because I want it to be an even number so I know I'm weird okay so now now we have 200 200 which is very cool because most of my savings challenges I've just added I've hit the hundred mark where I can pull the hundreds and put them in the chair. So now you can expect another video for me funding my cheer, my daughter's cheer season. Okay, so we finished with that one. Um, and now we are gonna go ahead and do winter savings. And winter savings is getting, what am I doing for winter? I'm doing a five and a 20. So we're gonna do these two little guys down here. And this is another one from Lisa Grateful Me. Like I said, she has way too many cute ones and makes it way too tempting. I could just have to pace myself. But I would like to have this one finished by the end of the month, latest first week in January. That is my goal. So hopefully I can get this done. I know a lot of you guys have been picking out your savings challenges that you're going to be working on and there's so many great ones. The hands and bands one is great. Um, the mom life. Oh my God. She's been flooding Etsy with new, new printables and challenges. And again, another one that I just want to do them all. Okay, so we're adding $25 to our winter savings. So let us see. Got too many pens around here. So we're adding plus 25. So let's see what we have in this one. Okay, so in this one we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 5, 10, 15. We broke the 100 mark. Okay, $115. Okay, and then let's see what else. Those are my main ones that, um, that I do every week. So I'm just going to see what else I can do. This one, I only do, um, I put money away when I do my bi-monthly uh, cash stuffing. So I don't have anything to put to this today. Anniversary savings challenge. I'm going to go ahead and um, what am I going to do? What should I do, guys? Let me see what I have. Okay, I got enough. I'm going to go ahead and do some rings for $15. So let's see. Let's do. So this, this challenge is up in my Etsy shop and my anniversary is in March. So I made this for myself to fund my anniversary. Um, so that is why most of the challenges you'll see in my Etsy shop are strictly because I needed one and I made it for myself. So um, you guys get the benefit of it if you're interested in getting that one. Okay, so we are adding 
$15. So let's see what I have in here now. Lots of fives, Chrissy. Okay. So we have 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, $70 in there. So that's awesome. And when I finish this one, I'll have a total of $305 in there. Let's see what's next. Etsy. So I do want to put some money towards supporting all you guys out there because without you, I, we wouldn't be here. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put two, four, six, eight. Let's finish this row out and put $8. Five, six, seven, eight. each of these boxes represents two dollars for me um, this printable came from the mom life so if you're interested in it I will pop her information up on the screen for you guys and um, you can basically customize it any way you'd like you can choose however much you want each envelope to represent um, I'm just gonna put what I can when I can in it and it'll allow me to keep buying from all you beautiful ladies that have Etsy shops. Okay, last one. And let me see, I don't even know if I have an envelope for it. Well, this is it, it's just not labeled. Okay, so we are adding, what did I say? $8, right? Add $8 for this one. So now that gives us $8. Five, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen dollars. Okay. And then Amazon. This is another printable by the Mom Life Studios, which is the Mom Life. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and put five in here. This is just so I can feed my shopping addiction on Amazon. Okay, so let's do one box. I know, I do a lot of savings challenges. It's a little excessive and crazy, but Unless it comes to a point where I can no longer afford to do these, I enjoy them. So I'm gonna keep doing them. So we're adding a five, so that gives us $15 in Amazon. And vacation, I'm just gonna, if I, I do this again, I put money aside for this specifically when I um, when I do my cash stuffing. And then after that starts my next year's savings challenges. So next year I'm gonna do the five tens and 21 from Hands and Bands. I'm doing my Valentine's savings challenge. This one is one that I created. Um, and this will probably start in January. And then the Christmas Savings Challenge, which is from What Was Mommy Thinking? Um, she also has an Etsy store, WWMT Mercantile on Etsy. Um, and she, it comes with these gorgeous little stickers. So this will help me get ready for next Christmas. Can't believe I'm even saying that when we haven't even had this Christmas, but it's all good. So I'm excited to do that one. 
Um, this is a New Year's savings challenge for the month of January that I had created for myself. So this one I will be doing. It's all very, pretty much low numbers. Ones, fives, a couple 20 sprinkled in here, but at the end of the day, we'll have $100 saved. The rainy day challenge, which is from Mom Life Studio on Etsy. And I have these other cute stickers. The stickers actually come from what was mommy thinking, but they go in their collab with the Mom Life Studios printables so I'm doing that one next year the planner challenge I'm doing and again we got the cute little stickers excited to start that one next year um, and then the tens the twenties and the oh, just tens and twenty savings challenge this is part of my vacation vibes so this the one I'm doing now is for 660 this one's worth 1,110. I don't have the money to do this big high one, so I'm not doing it. One month ahead is something I'm gonna work on next year, coming 2022. So this is a printable that I had created to get myself one month ahead. And I think that's it. And then these are just extra printables I had made that are in my shop. This is a teen savings challenge and then a kid's savings challenge. So let's see what I have left. And I don't have any singles or fives, believe it or not. Actually, let me look in my cash envelopes and see what I have. I have a one and one. I'm gonna save these fives because I'm doing the Christmas countdown and I take it from my own money so I'm not going to even bother um, giving away my fives because I need it for that otherwise I'll be completely broke okay that's it for my ones so we're going to just go ahead and throw those in my jar that is getting way too packed. I can't even get stuff out of it anymore. So in my dollar challenge, I have a hundred in my book. And then I have 20, 40, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67. So 167. I'm gonna run this to the end of the month and then guess what, You, I'm sure you did guess it, it's going to cheerleading. <sighs> so anyways, we have leftover, which will be going towards next week, five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26 dollars, which I will put back into here. And congratulations to Jocelyn from Cash Me in Paradise for hitting your 1K subscriber. Um, you deserve it, girl. Your videos are, s they always make me wanna go to Hawaii. Every time I see your video, I wanna go to Hawaii. Um, but I love all your videos and you're so supportive to everybody else. So um, anyways, Shy, I'm glad you're feeling better. We miss your video, so I'm glad you're starting to post again and we don't even mind your scratchy voice. But anyways, much love to all you guys. Thank you all for watching. Welcome to all and any new subscribers. And if you're watching for the first time, I hope you'll subscribe. You guys know I love talking to you and chatting in the comments. So make sure you leave a comment, like the video and all that good stuff. And I'll be back next week to do my regular weekly cash stuffing. I think it's next week. I don't even know. The dates got me all thrown off. Anyways, I will see you guys soon. Take care. Bye.